Triangle's biggest kids consignment sales happening right now at the State Fairgrounds in Raleigh. Bargains, bargains, bargains. Mm -hmm. CBS 17's Randy Ayala joining us live right now from the Jim Graham Building. And Randy, from what I see behind you, it's busy. <laughs> Yes, it's a field day out here at Bill and Liz. Look, everything is inside this building. You got the clothes behind me, shoes, toys, diapers, strollers, cribs. I mean, you name it, it's here. Any and everything a parent could need and a kid could want. We see you have a lot of people out here shopping, taking advantage. You know, this is a record setting year for the Kids Exchange consignment sale. More than 1,600 people are signed up to sell, and then there's more than 20,000 shoppers. Our largest kids exchange since the pandemic started. We don't know if it's folks that are just decluttering because they've been at home or if it's folks that are pandemic shopping for those pandemic babies that people keep joking about. But either way, it has been record setting for us. All right, back here live, you're getting a look at uh, the table. We've got sippy cups on here, more toys. I see little lunch boxes too, bowls. I mean, really, anything you could need for your kid. Keep in mind here, it is free, but you do have to register online. You have until 6 to come out today, and then you can shop from 9 to 4 tomorrow, and then 9 to 5 on Sunday. And Sunday, everything left will be 50% off. Uh, that's for the majority of items. So they tell me it's going to be about 80% of the stock here. Quick note, the sellers set their own price. So if you see an item three times, right, the same item, and it has three different prices, that's because it's up to the seller, and it's also up to the seller if they want to uh, participate in that 50% off markdown on Sunday. But they tell me the majority of the sellers do. Uh, but keep in mind, if something's marked full price, it will not be on sale. For now, live in Raleigh, Randy Ayala, CBS 17 News.